There is perhaps no one person who exemplifies the Arkansas Ole Miss rivalry more than Houston Nutt. Nutt, a former Arkansas QB, is granted the head coaching job at his alma mater in 1998, is forced to resign under scandal, and immediately jumps ship to rival Ole Miss. It's a tale almost as old as college football itself. While Nutt dominated the early 20th century of this rivalry, the Razorbacks and the Rebels have been doing battle since 1908. We'll take a look back at the top moments, Nutt's history in this rivalry, and why this SEC battle is so tense on this edition of Stadium Rivals. The rivalry kicked off in 1908, partly due to geography. Arkansas and Mississippi are neighboring states in the Southwest, and for the Razorbacks, Ole Miss was the closest school in terms of distance of any in their area. The schools were scheduled to meet for the first time in 1906, but due to a cancellation, the first meeting occurred in 08, a 33 to nothing Arkansas demolition. On paper, Ole Miss took down Arkansas 13 to seven in 1914. But the Razorbacks contend the Rebels used an ineligible player, something Ole Miss vehemently denies. The Rebels count the game as a forfeit, and because all of the players in the game are no longer living, it's unclear whether the issue will ever be resolved. As such, each school claims one additional win in their overall records. Arkansas made the Sugar Bowl for the second straight year, taking on Ole Miss in a game with national championship implications in 1963. The first TD of that game came on a 33-yard pass from Mississippi's Glenn Griffin to Lewis Gay to make it 10-3. After the Razorbacks tied it, Griffin scored on a one-yard run. Neither team scored in the fourth, and Ole Miss won the game 17-13, earning a share of the 1962 national championship, the last of Ole Miss's three titles. Just like 1963, number three Arkansas was coming into another Sugar Bowl after a win the previous year. The Razorbacks sat at 9-1, while number 13 Ole Miss was looking for an upset with a 7-3 record. Led by legendary QB Archie Manning and his 273 yards passing, a passing TD, and a rushing score, the Rebels upset the Razorbacks 27-22 in front of more than 80,000 fans. A side note, this was the final bowl game featuring two all-white squads as both schools desegregated their football programs in the early 70s. While both schools met annually from 1940 to 1947, in 1952 to 1961, the 1981 matchup marked the beginning of the still-running annual rivalry. Nutt was hired by Arkansas on December 10, 1997. Tasked with trying to reinvigorate the program, Nutt brought enthusiasm and high energy to the fan base. Number 11 Arkansas won that rivalry game 34 to nothing in a season where the Razorbacks would go 9-3, earning a share of the division title. November 3rd, 2001 saw a record setter in the Arkansas Ole Miss rivalry. Eli Manning was the QB for a 6-1 Ole Miss squad against the 4-3 Razorbacks. The game was tied at half and at the end of regulation, leading to seven overtime periods, becoming the longest game in NCAA history. Both teams scored in the first OT, as well as the third through seventh, but Manning failed to complete a pass on a two-point conversion, giving Arkansas the 58-56 win. Nutt went 7-3 against Ole Miss from 1998 to 2007. But after recruiting controversies and other off-the-field issues, Nutt was forced to resign at the end of the 2007 season. Less than four hours later, he was heading to Ole Miss to replace Ed Orgeron. While the fans in Fayetteville had grown tired of Nutt, he returned to face his former team the following year in a hate-filled showdown. On October 25, 2008, Nutt made it back to Fayetteville to take on Arkansas. This one hinged on an offensive pass interference call in the final minute that knocked Arkansas out of field goal range. Nutt and Ole Miss would sneak away with a 23-21 win. Arkansas came into the 2011 game looking for back-to-back -back victories over the Rebels. The teams were headed in opposite directions with Arkansas ranked in the top 10 and Ole Miss sitting winless in the SEC with Nutt on the hot seat. Despite Mississippi battling back from a 17-7 halftime deficit, the Razorbacks pulled out a 29-24 win and Nutt was fired just two weeks later. This one rivaled the 2001 game in terms of excitement. Trailing 52-45 in OT, Arkansas converted this miraculous play on 4th and 25. 4th and 25, it's complete to Henry, Ole Miss. 
knocks it away, incomplete. No correction, it's on lateral, Arkansas keeps it going. Collins is going to take it inside the 15. That insane lateral by Hunter Henry and company eventually led to a touchdown later in the drive. But head coach Bretton Bielema wanted to go for the win. They bring Morgan in motion again. Brandon gets the snap. He's going to keep the football into the end zone. Arkansas yeah. wins. Arkansas wins 53 to 52. Those are just a few of the moments that make Arkansas Ole Miss the rivalry it is today. With that disputed game, Ole Miss claims Arkansas leads 35-27-1 in the rivalry, while the Razorbacks give themselves an extra victory. From Houston Nut to crazy game endings, this SEC battle has made its mark as one of college football's best, perfect for a spot on Stadium Rivals.